Tanisha Wilding. I'm the executive pastry chef at Dough. Cake and pop culture, not sure which one I like more, but in this show, we combine both. Welcome to Meme Cakes. Chris Pratt has had a big week. Jurassic World is out. He just took home an MTV, <laughs> MTV movie and video. He won the MTV Video and TV Awards. He won a... You, you don't win the whole thing. He just won an MTV Movie and TV Award, and he's celebrating his 39th birthday. What better way to celebrate a birthday than with a Jurassic-sized cake? Hopefully he'll come by and blow out the candles. To start, we're gonna need to make a pancake batter and a waffle batter. So I'm gonna start with the pancake batter, but both items are gonna have the same ingredients, just different amounts. So we're gonna have flour, milk, some eggs, sugar, and I have my leavening agents too that you can't see. I have oil, a little bit of vanilla. We're gonna start with our dry ingredients, and I'm just gonna throw this in, whisk it up. You don't need to go crazy, just incorporate it. Now we'll start incorporating some of our wet ingredients. So first I'm gonna crack an egg. I always crack an egg on a flat surface, so you get a way more even crack. Don't whisk it in totally, just wanna get the yolk broken. Now I'm gonna pour in my oil my vanilla, and now I'm going to start slowly incorporating our milk. So pouring in about half of the amount, I'm gonna whisk that in first. Make kind of a thick batter before I thin it out with the rest of the milk. You wanna whisk carefully, because if you start going fast, you're gonna get flour all over the place. There we go, almost chunk free, so I can add the rest of the milk. Looking delicious. So now that my griddle is preheated, I am actually going to pour this pancake batter into what I use to measure the milk so it's easier to pour into the griddle. So now we're gonna make all the pancakes for our pancake stack. Spray the griddle. I'm gonna pour a big pancake. Apparently, Chris Pratt was homeless for a while, living in Hawaii, waiting on tables when he was discovered. So basically, there is hope for all of us. So same ingredients, same process, just different amounts. Making sure to not spill milk over the bowl. Whew, that's close. Now we are going to have our waffle iron sprayed. And we'll let that go. And now we wait. My favorite thing about Chris Pratt is definitely his goofy sense of humor. Well, yeah, then there's also Chris Pratt's devilishly good looks. <laughs> gorgeous. Not gorgeous. <laughs> That's okay, as Julia Child always says, you can always put it back together when you're alone in the kitchen. Who's to know? <laughs> Now that we have our waffles made, we're just gonna get cleaned up so we can get decorating. Let's do this. I'm gonna start by putting our waffles onto the base, and we're just gonna layer it. Waffle, pancake, waffle, pancake. And we have our cake. Now I'm going to start skewering our dino chicken nuggets. And we're just gonna carefully skewer this through it so we don't Totally poke through it, but enough to make sure that it is on there. And now this is the fun part. So I'm gonna start by putting on some dollops. Chris Pratt makes some pretty great faces, so I picked this one. I figured it matched his goofy humor. So now I'm just gonna cut a circle around his face, big enough to fit on top of the pancake nicely. And anyone can use edible imaging at home. You just need a brand new printer an edible sugar sheet and edible ink. That works for me. So now that we have a nice, beautiful shape, I'm gonna grab my paintbrush, a little bit of water, get the pancake damp on top, and I'm actually gonna wet the back of it just a little bit. Get it nice and smooth. Try not to touch it too much, just around the edges to make it stick. So now for the fun part, putting in the dino chicken nuggets. And we're just piercing very carefully through all of the pancakes and waffles, taking care to push them in very delicately. 
pipes and grass. And it can be haphazard, have fun with it. It is supposed to be a Jurassic theme. These can be on the maple syrup. There it is, our Jurassic birthday cake for Chris Pratt. All we need is him to come by and blow these candles out. I hope you had as much fun as I did. Let me know below in the comments what cake you'd like to see next.